right, so you want to schedule a meeting and you just here in your Zoom profile, you go to meetings and then click schedule a meeting or you can do that at the top as well. That will take you to the same place and you just um, schedule meeting for recording and cal calendar. So you pick your date, you pick your time, how long you want it. It's okay if your meeting go, starts earlier or goes longer. The time zone, keep in mind if you're doing calendar invite to specify which time zone the uh, calendar invite is indicating. Passcode is going to be part of the, the link. There's going to be a waiting room. You can, um, you know, if you were doing registration, you want both for audio and uh, if someone needs to call in or using the link automatically, I'm going to take that off and look at all of that and then you save. Now, as soon as you save, your meeting pops up and you can right there add it to a calendar. So it gives, you can copy invitation and paste that into an email and that will give you all the information including phone numbers by clicking uh, copy invitation and then paste it into an email that you already have set up. This is also where you set up polls, that sort of thing. But if you're not wanting to copy and put it into a calendar and you want to just right away pick your calendar system from these options, there is a way to add other calendar systems and there's other steps. But simply you can put it into a calendar right there. Um, it will save it into your calendar system. I picked the Google Calendar. All of that information is here. Now for it to be a calendar invite so that it can go into someone else's calendar and you can decide if you want them to be, um, to be able to invite others or see guest list, but you just simply add the email right here. Now it won't let me, um, oh, it's adding an extra, but you just put the calendar email right there into guests. Once you've pasted, like it can be, um, let's see here, regeareducation at gmail.com. You can just paste it in there right here if you wanted to paste an email address or type it in there. Then once you save, what you can do is it will say, would you like to send a calendar invite to the guests that you've added in there? And you can click send and then it will go into your calendar as well but that is how you can add it to a calendar system thanks for tuning in my name is Patricia Regeer with Regeer Educational Services. I hope that you had a light bulb aha moment watching this tutorial. And if you liked the video, giving it a thumbs up really means a lot to me, sharing it with other people, commenting. And of course, I welcome you to subscribe so that you can find out when different videos are available. We have some different opportunities right now that you can take advantage of. So you can take a look in the description and I hope you have a light bulb learning moment and that you're able to facilitate those for your participants.